Hey kids, this is Dan from the Kids Life team. How's your day been? Has it been good? Yeah? Awesome. Fox and I have been hanging out today doing some cooking in the kitchen, haven't we Foxy? Oh yes, we made some delicious cakes today. Um, we're going to read a bedtime story in a second because it's, uh, it's getting really late. Yeah, yeah, feeling sleepy. And today we want to read you a story all about praying. So Foxy, I'm going to put you down there. Is that okay? Yes, thank you very much. And we're going to read a book called My Very First Prayers. Let's have a look, shall we? This is my prayer book to help me to pray. I like to read it each and every day. It tells me how, when and what I need to do. My prayer book helps me speak to God with awesome pictures too. It's pretty cool pictures. Got a dog, got a bunny, got a nice sunny day. It's pretty cool. You can pray when traveling in the car or riding on your bike, ding ding, or when looking out the window at the shining stars at night. You can pray when you're running, <laughs> who's really fast here? I bet you're really fast. Or pray when you are still. You don't need long words, anything will do. Pray early in the morning or at the end of the day. Whatever time it is, God hears all that you say. Pray with your eyes closed or open, standing tall or with your head bowed. You can pray just by thinking, or you can say the words out loud. You can pray on your own, with a friend or even two. You can pray with your mum at bedtime, she loves to pray with you. Whoever you may pray with, wherever you may be, I can guarantee for certain God listens to you and me. Say you're sorry if you've upset friends or not been very kind. God forgives you and won't keep it in his mind. He won't remember it, he'll forget. And as you learn how to pray, you'll get to know God too. You'll learn that God is kind and good and always loving you. So as you wake each morning and start a brand new day, remember that God looks forward to listening when you pray. Praying to God is such a great thing to do. He loves to listen to everything that's going on in our world. Let's remember to always talk to God because God is always listening and he loves and cares for us so much. Have a great sleep. See you next time.